Stakeholders, especially those in government, recognize the value of a post-conflict needs assessment to help guide government as it continues to rehabilitate the once war-torn city of Marawi. Johara Didato of PIA Lano del Sur has the full details. Some line agencies have continuously joined forces to refine the updated post-conflict needs assessment or PCNA report detailing the evaluation of the aftermath of the historic firefight that transpired in Marawi City in 2017. Presidential Assistant for Marawi Rehabilitation Assistant Secretary Felix Castro Jr. stressed that this was a crucial undertaking as the outcome would serve as one of the basis of the MCB in the compensation of siege victims. This was affirmed by the OCD, who stated that the required data outlined in the document are indeed seen as essential elements in the works of the MCB, especially that this would also cover all the narratives of concerned sectors. I wish that they will be able to deliver the, the data and they will, be able, they will be able to finalize because uh, this is needed very badly. The OCD also shared that they collaborated with the Marawi city government to request for supporting information and the MCB for solid observation and suggestions on what else to incorporate in the existing draft sectoral report. The OCD noted that the report was already 85% done and they are committed to wrap this up by the end of November this year. extension. We really have to finish this. No choice but uh, the participants to really have to work overtime. Juhay Redidato of the Philippine Information Agency, Lano del Sur, for The Nation.